hello friends today i am going to show you how to reset the sa password okay so i will tell you my real time scenario so one of my client asked me to take the backup from the instance where i am not i am and the client doesn't having any permissions on sql server so the the previous admin left the organization without any notice so now click on notification with click now so here i am having public permissions it means i can view the databases just name but when i try to access it will get uh, client me and client is also facing this issue so now he asked me to take the brute force sql server and force add one of the login as a sysadmin okay for that for that you need to login into the sql server where sql server got installed type cmd and select run as administrator option now uh, you need to disconnect first here and uh, net stop now i am doing for default instance okay for name instance that syntax little bit different okay i will show you that how to uh, reset the sa password the named instance as well in the next video okay so currently my agent is in stopped state so that's the reason it is not asking to restart my agent if if our agent is in start starting then it will ask to stop okay press you need to press y button okay now you need to start the sql server into single user mode net start ms sql server backward slash small m okay type sql cmd okay now it was started now type sql cmd okay create a login ravi with password is equal to capital ravi at the rate one at the rate at the rate one two three okay she press press shift button press go so now it will come go now press control enter sorry now create a login not login right okay press go okay now sp underscore add server role role member okay um, login login name ravi comma single quotations type sysadmin shift enter go normal enter okay so now we have forced the sql sub forcefully added ravi login with sysadmin credentials okay now we need to stop the sql server to from going out of single user mode for that we need to exit okay net stop sql server i need to net stop them we need to remove that okay now i will let you know select select authentication for example if the sql server in windows and authentication mode i have done a video as well how we can change authentication mode even we don't have a permission using windows registry i will paste that link as well in the video description now uh, ravi ravi there are 1 2 so 3 now i am able to successfully connected okay now let's go to security login go to ravi see this he is having sys admin credentials now you can reset the sa password right click on properties okay reset the sa password and disable enable the login as well okay so this is how you need to reset or the sa password or you can forcefully add one login into the sql server with whatever permissions do you want 
so i think you if you encountered any kind of this situation you might like like this video i hope uh, you like the process what i have showed now okay give your feedback thank you bye